the iCracker here and today I wanted to show you how you can get to the exact live wallpapers that are on the iPhone 10 on your jailbroken 64-bit device and this will also work on devices that do not support 3D touch like the iPhone 5s, 6, 6 plus and uh, all the iPads from iPad 2 and up and also all the iPad mini series so to get these you're gonna need a specific repo which will be in the description below uh, so you can jump into Cydia yeah like and you're gonna have to want add this repo right here 105120.github.io you're gonna press that and then um, all packages and then just and then just look for X dynamic wallpapers and X live wallpapers, which is basically the iPhone 10 live wallpapers and the iPhone 10 exclusive dynamic wallpapers. Uh, alternatively, you can search this with the search option. Just type in X, and it should come up right at the top. So once you find them, uh, first you're gonna go on uh, X live wallpapers. You're gonna tap that and you're going to press install and then continue queuing and then you're going to go back and then you're going to tap x dynamic wallpapers you're going to tap that press install and then confirm now press confirm if you are running a 6s 6s plus 7 7 plus on uh, that are jailbroken because they support 3D touch for live wallpapers uh, but there is a way to get this on older devices that do not support 3D touch and to do that what you're going to do is you're going to press continue queuing you're going to go back here and then go to search and then what you're going to type in is excuse me uh, you're going to want to type in peak uh, and then you want to type in peekaboo and then what you're going to do is press the first one as you can see it's made by creatix and uh, what you're going to do is you should have an install button here i've already got installed because this is an iphone 6 uh, so i've already got this installed but what you're going to do is press install and then confirm again now once you have them all in one you're going to want to press confirm and then what it's going to do it's going to install it on your device it's going to first download it then it's going to install the wallpapers so it might take a while because the download is 88 megabytes so depending on your internet connection speed this will vary so once that's done and downloaded what you're going to do is press restart springboard so once you're back at the springboard you're going to go to settings and then you go know, all the way down to uh, wallpaper and as you can see you have now the dynamic wallpapers and the live wallpapers once you go to dynamic you have all these uh, these are only available on the iPhone 10 uh, if you purchase the, the device these wallpapers are exclusive literally to the iPhone 10 and now you have them on your jailbroken 64-bit device or 32-bit if you're on iOS 9 and uh, now you have these wallpapers uh, I'm guessing they I'm not sure actually I'm not sure if they work on iPad but uh, I don't really see why they wouldn't work on iPad but I don't think they're optimized just yet uh, so if you're on iPad I'd say wait for that but as you can see if you go here so once you go and check out one of the well, let's go check out one of the wallpapers so let's see this one as you can see it's black mainly because the iPhone 10 uh, has an OLED display and this wallpaper looks really good on the iPhone 10 and yeah it looks uh, really good on here as well so it's like every other dynamic wallpaper and you just move your device and it will move with you but as you can see these are very nice dynamic wallpapers see there's a there's a, a green one and then you obviously got a yellow one and then you've got like a bronzish gold color
for that. I know that you that might may not be like picking it up on the camera, but um, it's just, I'm just saying what it looks like. Uh, you got a red one here. As you can see, the very very nice wallpapers. See this as well. Very nice purple wallpaper. And last but not least, uh, you've got a very nice blue wallpaper if you're into that, if your color is blue. And of course, we've got the live wallpapers, as you can see, all the 6S wallpapers. And also, if you look at the bottom, all the iPhone 10 wallpapers. So you press one, apply a bit of force to the screen, and it, as you can see, it moves. And same for this one. That moves as well, very nice animations. And this one as well. As you can see. And and also you've got this wallpaper as well. Which was actually used in the iPhone 10 advertisements and the reveal videos. As you can see, the very nice wallpapers. And going to this one. As you can see, very, very nice wallpapers. Um, and seeing as uh, you have installed Peekaboo on your device, on your non-supported uh, 3D Touch device, you, you now get the functionality of 3D Touch on icons. So as you can see, settings, your phone, reminders, uh, let's say App Store, or Snapchat, uh, YouTube, and pretty much any app that does support 3D Touch will um, work on this. So if you want to increase the sensitivity, you're going to want to head back into settings and then go all the way down till you find Peekaboo, as you can see, Peekaboo settings. And as you can see, mine is at 44. Uh, I believe that's 48.4 uh, seeing as that works for me but um, have a play with the slider and see what's best for you because 48.4 uh, is best for me so it depends on how much uh, pressure you apply to the screen um, and this isn't just like them you know just touch and hold because if I touch and hold you'll get wiggle mode uh, if I do that again okay Okay, that's not working. Uh, yeah, should, if you just hold, there you go. Wiggle mode. So I'm, I am actually going to apply force now. There you go. As you can see, I've applied force and it does work. So it'd be like a 6S. However, you won't have that same taptic engine feel of the 6S and 7. Uh, so, I mean, that's a bummer, but I mean, come on, these devices were released before the Taptic engine was made. Uh, I know the iPhone 6 was released alongside the Apple Watch, which did, which did have the Taptic engine in it, but I mean, it was a first generation Apple Watch, so I mean, they weren't going to bring it to iPhone that soon. I mean, they, but they did bring it in a year later for the 6S. But anyway, that is pretty much how you get li the live dynamic wallpapers on uh, uh, your jailbroken 64-bit device and 32-bit device. Um, I, again, I'm not sure if this works on iPads, but have a go. If it works, let me know in the comments below. Uh, and any problems, feel free to comment below, and I'll try to get back to you as soon as I can. Uh, yeah, for that, that's about it for this video, guys. I'll see you in the next one.